Smith in trouble. Oh, Rhea Ripley. Trying to help out Dominic. What up, y'all? It's your boy Ace here. And welcome to Afternoon Select. Shoes. Shoes, please. So we had uh, the Alpha Academy Chad Gable on the oldest face of Damian Priest and Damian Dominic Mysterio. This is basically kind of a warm-up match for Damian and Down to get ready for the Usos next Monday. They got a huge tag team match for those titles. I went over the first video how, uh, you know, we saw both of them kind of getting like an almost like a little gang war type uh, promo in the beginning. So good stuff here, man. Um... So let's go to the end of the match and see how this ended and uh, see how your girl Rhea Ripley got involved again. So Priest slammed Otis from the ropes. Gable returned to the ring and suplexed Priest. Uh, Dom rolled up Gable, who uh, countered it to an ankle lock. And then that's when Ripley distracted the referee. That's all. They, once she does that, that's all they wrote. That's all they wrote, man. Then the Damian Priest hit his South of Haven choke slam on Gable. Which led to Dom scoring the pin. So after he got that roll up before this, um, you know, he was able to get the pin here. Barely even pinning him though. Like he had his arm because he was struggling with his ankle, I think. Uh, but they ended up winning in about eleven minutes. So they beat off uh Chad Gable and Otis. The two jobbers are raw at this point. Um But yeah, the, the fans was uh, really loving what baby uh, baby Fuzz Otis did because he did like a little fake worm thing. <laughs> Like he did, he tried to do the worm brush. It was funny doing the match. Good stuff, man. Uh, but it seems like Otis is more the like the 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 baby face while Chad Gable's more the heel. But uh he just doesn't get they don't get booked right, man. But I I really think Chad Gable could be like another Kurt Angle, bro. If they booked him a lot more correctly, man. But it, it's a shame. But he had Damian Priest a down win and Rhea Ripley once again. I talked about how early in the night she stood up to Solo's cold. There's still no accountability for Rhea Ripley against the men, bro. She continues to get their way. And that's why she's such an X factor for the Judgment Day. It's going next week against the Usos. Now, the Usos are way step up. You're talking about one of the best tag teams of all time. If, if Rhea Ripley is ringside and she's able to pull this off, it's gonna be big here man but let me know y'all okay you guys make sure y'all going ahead and hit the like button comment and share the video also make sure you guys also donate to the channel by hitting the thanks button below or you can hit up the cash app dollar sign sack exchange to send any donation to the cash app here are the top donators and you can fit yourself in this list at any time if you donate at least two dollars or more thank you so yeah, yeah, man. This is uh it's gonna be an interesting match next week, man. I wanna see a Damien and Dom already for the Usos. Um now Damien and Dom as a tag team have been working together that long. Jimmy and Jay Uso know each other. They know how to like especially with the ropes and stuff like that. They're gonna really need help from Rhea in this match. I don't know if Rhea's gonna be ringside or not, but they're gonna need hella help from Rhea ringside. Because Jimmy and Jay are so good. I hope they allow Solo and Rhea to be ringside because I want to see another face-to-face -face between those two. Now, Rhea should not be having a match against Solo Sokoa. Not at all. Not at all. I'm an intergender guy, but I don't want to see that. I don't want to see that. But I do like how she stood up to Solo Sokoa, though. I do like that. But they can't have Solo Sokoa looking weak against Rhea. It just can't happen. Solo Sokoa is too much of a badass. They built him up. Through this point, he can't. He cannot... He cannot uh, lose to Rhea, man. So let's we'll see how this goes, guys. Uh, definitely going to put up a poll next week uh, asking y'all who's going to win this match. So definitely be on the lookout for that. Thank y'all for watching this one. Afternoon's delight.